this video, take a regular chicken egg. I'm going to show you how to make a nice little Valentine's Day gift out of a chicken egg for someone special. You'll need a Dremel, some Dremel bits, a little wire, and a drill bit, and a cutoff wheel, and a pencil or pen, and maybe some ribbon or something to decorate it with when you're done. And that's it. Now, the first thing you want to do is you want to poke a hole in the uh, egg so that you can get the uh, egg yolk and the egg white out. Now, I do have three eggs because sometimes it happens. You break them. Now what I do is I just drill a hole. I just drill a hole on either end and then just poke at it with that and then blow it out. Now here's what I do, it makes it a little bit easier. I take a wire, break it all up. There's a little membrane in there, and if you don't break that completely, and I've also found if it helps to break the yolk, that you will have a really hard time getting that egg out. And there we go. Then I'm going to draw just a simple heart. Right on the egg. Then I'm going to take the cutoff wheel. And basically, my first cut is going to be right across here. Then I'm going to take and I'm going to cut this line and this line, and this I'll cut with the cutoff wheel. This part here, since it's rounded, I will use the uh, sanding wheel. That's the plan. Let's see if it works. And generally, when I'm doing this, what I'm trying to do for the camera, I will cup the egg, and that will absorb a lot of the vibration that the uh, Dremel tool generates under the egg. I think I may have to change the cutoff wheel. There. Now we got the first basic cut done. Now what we're going to have to do is cut the rest of it out. So let's go to the sanding wheel and see how that works. And if it's a little too aggressive, then we'll switch to a finer cutoff wheel. Now see, I'm just taking off a little bit at a time. I'm not getting real aggressive with it. I'm just very gently letting the tool grind it on down. <clears throat> there, now I've got the basic done. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go with the finer, the smaller grinding wheel, and I'm just going to touch up a few little areas. Inside the egg, there's that membrane that we were talking about. I just take my finger and roll over it. And try to get that free. Okay, there it is so far. Now what we have to decide is what we're going to do to decorate it. What I want to use, and I think I'm going to use some of this ribbon here because it's red and I kind of want to stay in the, the spirit of Valentine's Day since it's a little heart. 
snip it off. Now, you can cut, there's a little pattern in there, and you can cut that pattern out if you want. I'm just going to cut right down the center. I'm going to take, loop it, and I'm going to go ahead and stick it right on in there. Get a little wire. And I want to leave enough so that it'll hang. You can actually put it on something to hang it up. Now, if you see inside there, where it's coming through, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take and I'm going to put some glue right on top there. And I'm going to take the tool and I'm going to put some glue all the way around the opening. Now, with white glue or craft glue, I would have waited a little bit to do that. Because it dries a little faster. Okay, now I got the, the beads strung. And I'm just going to take them and push them right where I want them. And the nice thing about having the string is you can pull them tight so that they all stay all nice and lined up. Just nip it, pull it back the other way. The string's out. Now I'm going to give that a second to set up, and I'm probably going to run a second string around it. On the batting, where your cotton. And I'm just going to take and just kind of get it on there. This is going to do a couple of things. It's going to add some decoration to it. And it's going to hide that where the ribbon is, where you put the ribbon. And that's up there as a cloud. I'm going to take a little bit more of this, and I think yeah, that might be enough. And this, I'm going to go ahead and dip into the glue because my. I'm, I'm going to put it on the bottom. I'm going to take a little pencil and shove it in there area here. Because once I get it in there, I don't want it to fall out. I'm going to go ahead and stick it in. And kind of poke it into that batting. And there we go. Now the other thing I was thinking is that a little ribbon, a little bow would be nice on there. Slide that on top. Then I'm going to put one more string around there and uh, I'll be back to show you the finished product. And there you go. There's the finished egg. And I think I will probably find another bird and put another bird in there. It'll be a pair of love birds, and that'll be the gift. And as you can see, it'll hang. I think that's a gift that anybody would be proud to give and or get as a Valentine's Day gift. Well, until next time, I hope you give it a try. Don't give up. You may break one or two egg shells, but uh, keep going. It's well worth it. Thanks for watching.